just uh, broke down back here. I'm trying not to sweat. So I'm loosening my clothing. It'll be a long walk. I want to go to Morberley, but I broke up way broke down way up there in the bush. Well, I just came across this lake and now I'm heading to my second portage. This one's not very long, but the next lake's a little bit longer. Well, <coughs> coming to the end of this portage and I gotta cross this lake here now. Shouldn't be too bad and Morbidi's not too far there. I have now arrived at portage number three. Start the snow, but that's where I came from. Long walk. I want to make a fire in this board up portage and rest for a while. Started my fire. Gonna have my coffee. Relax here a bit. I don't want to get too sweaty. Just take my time walking to Moberly. And hopefully by tonight the alarm will come and Somebody will come looking for me. Okay, until uh, the next portage. Well, I'm at the end of portage number three, and there's Long Lake, little Long Lake. Just entered port, portage, portage number four. And I gotta walk along these willows, and then I'll hit Jackfish Lake. The little rivers aren't quite freezing this year. Normally this place would probably be frozen. But they're still flowing. Gotta be really careful along the river. See the river flowing here along the beaver dam. There's the beaver dam here. Last time I was through here all of this was open. See it's frozen in a bit. Normally we're able to skidoo on that, not this year. Try that, we'll fall through. Oh, you can hear that river. That was the end of portage, portage number four. And I'm off to Jackfish Lake. And then on to portage number five. I've just crossed Jackfish Lake. Now, I want portage number five. Then Danny's Lake is just on the other side there. Then one more portage and I'll be in Morbury. Almost at Danny's Lake, just over there. Well, I've just crossed Danny's Lake. We named this lake Danny's Lake because he loves this lake. As you can see, he's got some, uh, he'd been here last week and he had been fishing and these are his tip-ups, had hooks on there, but he loves it here, he likes fishing for trout and Xander Lake is that way and my last portage is just around this point and out to Moberly. Several years ago I was driving down here and I hit this depression hole here and I tipped between the trees and I couldn't get out. I couldn't upright my skidoo and I had to end up walking to Moberly Lake. Ernest and uh, Al showed up early in the morning, picked me up, came back and rescued my machine and on to Turner Lake. I finally arrived on Moberly Lake. And that's where I'm going. And yeah. Around that point is my bro's cabin. Bit of a walk, but not too long now. I am about halfway across Moberly. The old legs are starting to give out. Like 
the saying goes, they're not as good as there once was, but they're good once as there ever was, and I think that once is kind of fading about this time. So I'm just kind of struggling the last mile or so here. Alrighty, here's my bro's beautiful cabin. Shelter, warmth, coffee, movie, then wait for someone to rescue me. Welcome to Moverly Lake. Thank you, bro.